Hey everybody, Derek here from Addictive Tips. In this video, I'm going to show you how to set up passwordless sudo. And what that will do is it will allow you to enter any sudo command without entering the password. So to start off, we need to open up a terminal window. We do that. Now from here, you need to change your password to something secure if you remember it already. That way, yes, you can sudo without command, without entering your password, but for someone to log into your account, they need to know your password, and if it's secure, it's, it'll be much safer. So from there, we need to edit our sudo file, and we can do that with one of these two commands. Once we're in the sudo file, we need to scroll down and uh, need to scroll down and copy this command here. So in the sudo file, look for root. And now root is right here. We can add our new command line here. Now for user, I need to change my user to the, the user word here. I need to change this to my actual user account. I can do that with just replacing it and then I press control O to save and then I can do control X to exit. Now once I'm out of here, I'm going to close my terminal and I'm going to reopen it. Now normally, and I'm using Arch Linux, if I needed to resync my password, or not my password, <laughs> excuse me, if I need to resync the servers, so like to check for updates, I would do sudo pacman syuu. And uh, now this normally asks for my password, but because I have set up password with sudo, I can run this command and I don't need to be pestered with entering a sudo command. I can even do like sudo cd etsy sudo rsd, which is normally something that I can't access without entering the sudo command, but normally that works. <laughs> Let's see. Let's try a different one that works. Normally, I have to enter my password to access a shell, so I can just do sudo s, and as you can see, it just lets me in. It doesn't make me enter my password. While I'm not a huge fan of passwordless sudo, I only really use it on certain programs on a server of mine. And by the way, you can also specify this so it only runs with certain commands. So like, I have in the example I have for CP, but let's say you wanted to like uh, execute like a script as sudo, but you can't be there to enter your password all the time. You can just specify the location of the script and then that one will only run without a password, but everything else will just be you have to enter your password. So anyways, guys, that's how you can set up sudo so you can run stuff without a password. Please check out the, the article that I wrote in the description for more information and I will see you guys in the next video.